Hello folks. I'd like to demonstrate to you what fuses are and what you what and what they're used for. And to do this, I'm having a power supply, I'm having a lot of light bulbs. And all the light bulbs they use current of course. I will switch them on one by one. Uh, the, the, the current of the power supply has to run through a fuse and through an ampere meter. So all the current you can see up here has to run through the fuse. So you're cooking in the kitchen. So what do you need first is having some light in the kitchen. I will turn on the first device which is light. And as you can see this light uses a lot of current. But next to light is starting cooking, so you need the microwave. So you switch on the microwave. And what you can see is the current is going up. All the current being used has to run through the fuse. So the next thing I'm going to use is a, is a water cooker. Let's switch on the water cooker and see what happens. Actually nothing, because this fuse can carry all that current without any problem. But some dishes are getting dirty, so you also need a dishwasher. You switch on the dishwasher, still no problem. The fuse can still handle it and the current is still going up. Oh, meanwhile I get thirsty, so I want to drink a cup of coffee. So I switch on the coffee machine. And now you can see some difference over here, because right now I'm using so much power that the fuse is heating up inside. It's heating up but still working. So I might use another device. I was about to gonna use a mixer but meanwhile the fuse already burned. What does it mean? The fuse burned inside. Well that's good news because because the fuse burned inside Doing so, it protected the other wires in my kitchen from burning. There's a weak spot, that's the fuse, and it burns before the other spots can burn, like the wires in my kitchen. That's what it's for, protection of my electric installation.